They say that even the largest avalanche is triggered by small things, but some of the rock falls in this video are so big, it's hard to imagine they were started by a mere pebble. Hey, remember that time a piece of Norway just floated out to sea? No? Well, here's the proof. Ah, there's nothing like a nice, relaxing waterfall. Wait a minute. That's not water! There's no point having a bridge if the other side doesn't exist. What's the last thing you ever want to see during a bus journey? This. This construction worker makes sure the rocks don't fall on motorists or pedestrians as they go about their commute. And here's a rock that only needed a quick nudge to pose a threat to anyone passing below. There's an art to splitting massive stones in half. And this is what it looks like. The one thing you don't want to hear when you're in this kind of landscape is the sound of ice cracking nearby. Followed by this horror-inducing sight. When you witness this event during a school trip, you really have to thank the teacher who planned the route. This landslide is not only pretty scary, it was apparently the second one he'd encounter during that journey. Here's a perfect definition of the word almost. Holy sh this rock slide has not only ruined the day for these beachgoers, it's also covered up the entrance and exit of the beach. If you're traveling through the Philippines, then you might want to avoid this road. Ever wondered why you should wear safety gear to go rock climbing? Here's why! Free climbing is extremely scary. And never more so than when you grab a loose rock. This is not gonna hurt. <laughs> when it comes to bouldering, you don't need to be up high to get yourself in trouble. Whoa! Whoa! Here's some more glacial calving. An immense amount of it. A shocking moment, but probably the safest place to view it from. For decades, police have been looking for an effective way to make motorists slow down. I bet they never considered this. Not the most encouraging sight when you're heading up a rocky hill. Here's a landslide that just doesn't seem to stop. Where's it all coming from? One second later, and this guy would have been shopping for new windscreens. You know you've had heavy rain when the road becomes a waterfall. When you suddenly realize why the rent to your apartment is so cheap. Here's one place you definitely shouldn't lay out your beach towel. The driver of this car was wearing a Flash t-shirt, but it would have been more appropriate to wear one with the rock on it. Well, that's certainly an effective way to prune your trees.
You know that feeling when the road suddenly gets eaten by the scenery? Okay, okay. If it doesn't take out a few trees on the way down, then is it even really a boulder? This was the result of heavy rains in Hawaii. All caught on camera by a very enthusiastic person. Oh my god! This rock has clearly had enough of life as a rock. This bus journey is going to get one hell of a bad TripAdvisor review. They scrambled up the valley to avoid a flash flood and headed straight into a landslide. That must be the dictionary definition of bad luck. Videos of icebergs breaking up are getting pretty common. Which should be getting us pretty concerned, right? This landslide in Russia looks like some kind of slowly moving and very hungry creature. This rockfall was spotted on a very famous landmark, El Capitan at Yosemite National Park. Small landslides don't take long to become large landslides, as this unfortunate car found out. Come on, admit it! If you live near an abandoned coal mine rescue shaft, then you throw a big rock down it too. A cyclone in New Zealand resulted in this massive landslide. This may look like a fast-flowing river, but it's actually an avalanche of water and mud. Remember the guys who threw the rock down the mineshaft? Well, these guys have a similar method of entertaining themselves. Yeah, those traffic cones haven't just been placed there for fun. It takes some courage to climb Mont Blanc, but even an experienced mountaineer must get sweaty palms when he sees this. That dog is pretty relieved he decided not to relieve himself next to that cliff. It's not often you see an iceberg collapse, but if you do, then you'd better be prepared to avoid the wave that comes afterwards. A relaxing day out on the boat suddenly turns into a minor catastrophe! Oh my god! If you see this, then run. And, you know, maybe put down the camera! All avalanches are bad, but especially when you're camped right in the path of one. This avalanche isn't very obvious at first. Until you see this guy's store just disappear into the river. Yeah, you may want to take the long way round. Here's another massive chunk of glacier, and the massive wave that follows it. When half the cliff suddenly disappears, you should probably get the hell off the cliff! I'll get out of here! Another snowy avalanche cascading down like a dropped bottle of talcum powder. Holy shit. 
If there was ever a good time to check that your brakes work, then it's now. Oh, that's not gonna come down here, is it? No, that is. Is it? Yeah, this is a big one, all right. And unlike some of the clips we've seen, that's also an appropriately safe distance to film from. D well, okay, maybe not. Apparently, bears sometimes throw boulders over cliffs when they're searching for food. Maybe they're trying to get the attention of the chef? There are moments you should film, and moments you should run the hell away from! There's one avalanche you don't want to avoid, and that's the avalanche of videos coming your way from Retrocast. So, before you roll away, why not take a moment to click subscribe?